So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to Steam and then click on your library. Then you want to find the game you're having a problem with. You want to right click on it and then click on properties and then head over to installed files and then click on verify integrity of game files. For the second step, you want to head over to search and type in task manager. Click on it. Once you're on this, you want to close out Steam. So you might need to scroll down to find Steam, but once you find it, you want to click on it and then click on end task. Then once you do that, you want to head over to the details tab and then do the same thing. Scroll down and then look for Steam. Once you find it, you want to right click on it and then click on end process tree and then click on end process tree again. Then on your desktop in the bottom right, you want to click on the arrow. And then if you find Steam again right here, you want to right click on it and then click on quit. Or it might say exit for you. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in Steam. Then you want to right click on it and then click on open file location. Then once you're on this, you want to right click on the Steam application and then click on properties and then head over to the compatibility tab. And then you want to tick run this program in compatibility mode disable full screen optimizations and run this program as administrator and then click on OK. For the next step, you want to head over to search and type in sound settings. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure that the correct output device has been selected. It's probably going to be your headset. So this one's mine right here, I selected it. And then you want to scroll down and then click on more sound settings. And then on the playback tab, you want to make sure that your output device is set as your default device. So for me, in my case, I've got my headset and I'm going to click on set default and then the green tip will appear here. Now once you do that, you want to scroll down again and then click on volume mixer. And now you want to head over to search and type in Steam, click on it, which will then make Steam appear right here. Then you want to click on Steam and then make sure that your correct output device has been selected. Now for the last step, you want to head over to search and type in device manager, click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to expand audio inputs and outputs. Then you want to find your output device. This one's mine right here. You want to right click on it and then click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers for your device have been installed. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.